Yo guys, what is up? Welcome back to the new video. Today we're hopping into iRacing. We are heading to Michigan and we're going to talk Quest 2 resolution frames and why I run at 72 frames per second or 72 hertz and I don't go to 80, 90 or 120. So let's hop into it and let's get racing. All right, guys, here we go. We were at Michigan. This is, this is a carburetor cup. I enjoy racing these non-official races. It takes a little bit of stress off. You can enjoy yourself. Um, of course, you're racing with all different levels of drivers so and and you know a lot of drivers are just gonna gonna probably do things they probably might not do in an official race but that's okay because we don't get stressed out when we wreck but this is gonna be a little bit of fun we're on the quest 2 we're gonna talk a little bit of quest 2 why i actually run 72 hertz and not higher so we'll discuss that as we get into the race we are pulling up to the starting line um i am p7 i didn't get much practice in i actually just ran like one practice lap and Ran into qualifying. I have raced this track before, but I would have liked a little more time to, to warm up. And we'll just we'll just uh, we'll just see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. It's a short race, 20 laps, 20 laps. We're getting ready to start here, so let's let's uh, let's get started. Let's settle in, and then let's let's talk a little a little VR in Quest Two. Go, go, go. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Not sure what happened there. Not sure what happened there. Definitely not looking to win the race on the first lap. We're just going to try to settle in here. Everyone hopefully just takes it a little bit chill here. We don't want to lose it. All right. Here we go, guys. Here we go. We can pull up here. We can pull up here. We are clear. Want to make sure we don't spin out here. Keep control. Keep control. Always just want to like settle in those first couple laps. Not try to be too aggressive. You don't want to lose your car. Warm up those tires. I got a car on the inside, which obviously has some bad connection, flipping and jumping. Very distracting to drive when you see that. It's hard to make moves when that car in front of you is just like all over the place. That is just like bugging out there, bugging out. I don't know what to do. It's hard, it's hard to really drive aggressively around a car that's jumping. We're going three wide here. We're going three wide. S stay down, buddy. Stay down. Stay in your lane. You want to go three wide? Stay in your lane, buddy. We're going to come up high here. So, so the reason why I run 72 hertz, I'm running an, R I'm running an RTX 3080. I have an i7 10th gen. I can obviously run higher frames per second. But the reason why I run 72 is first of all, right now we're running super smooth. I have no complaints how smooth the driving actually is at 72. But what it allows me to do is run my Quest 2 at the highest possible resolution that you can actually run this thing in. And to me, that is that is huge. It is it is like so clear. It is so clear. It is crystal clear. The resolution just looks looks amazing to me, and and to me that 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 trumps the higher frames when it comes to VR. Now, of course, if we're playing on like a flat monitor or a flat screen, you know, you're looking for those high frame rates, right? Because it's still it's still going to be clear. It's always going to be clear. It's just a matter of how detailed the graphics are if you need to pump stuff down. But when you're talking about VR and resolution. To, to me, that's like that's like king. That's like that's like king. What place? We're running. We're running. We're running P8 right now. No right. No wrecks ahead of us. So so that that's why I run 72. So I'm able to pump all my graphics up like in iRacing. I'm able to run at the highest possible highest possible resolution, and it just looks amazing. So for me to go to like 80 or 90 and drop down the resolution even just a little bit. Like, it's just, I, I don't see the benefit personally. And if you guys have, have a computer that can actually push the Quest 2 at 72 hertz, at 72 frames, you know, hertz and frames, they say are different, but you're going to run 72 frames per second if you're on 72 hertz. So if you have it, you know, you just have to play around with it. You, you have to see it. So put it on the highest possible resolution 
and see how clear that system is. Uh oh, uh oh. We have to avoid. We have to avoid a wreck right there. And, and like, it's just so clear. And of course, you want to make sure that you that you're able to like keep your bit rate up. So if you know if you're if you're sacrificing going to a high resolution, but your bit rate and you get all that compression in your headset, it's gonna look bad with all that compression. But you know, I do make sure I'm getting I'm getting a high bit rate. So I set that. I set that bitrate manually, so I'm always getting like a nice bitrate and running at the highest resolution. And that car is just like bugging me out. He's just like flipping all around. I don't even know how he's still in the race. All right, so we're still running P8. We're not really gaining on that front pack. We're kind of all just, we're all kind of just, you know, chilling here in the same. We got, um, how many laps we got here? We got 14 to go. But we're, we're still in it. We're still in this front pack here. Not many cars behind us. But but like run, running the Quest 2 at, at the highest resolution, it's such a... Like, it, it looks so good. It looks so good. Um, I, I just I just can't... I just can't sacrifice it for the higher frames. I, I've tried... I tried pumping it up. You know, maybe even going to 80 and dropping it down like a notch or two is fine. But like... Like pushing the 90 or the 120, and I know people are gonna comment, oh, I run 120 on the highest setting possible, and I have like a 2060 Super or a 1080 Ti. Like I I'm not buying it. And if you are running at the highest resolution, at uh oh, let's avoid this wreck. If you are running at the highest resolution, you know, on a 1080 Ti, it it, it means it means you're it means you're getting a lot you're getting a lot of compression, a lot of compression. For your, head, for your headset to run at that at that high of a resolution, your your bit rate is probably really low, and you're getting a lot of compression. So you're seeing like a lot of blurriness, like the the track. You're not you don't you won't see the details in the track. It'll kind of be blurry. Um, when you're running like a nice high bit rate, you'll actually see all the details. You don't get that compression that that people are used to seeing. You know, using like a Quest Two with a with a cable. So if you're seeing a lot of that compression, it means it means that your your computer probably can't push the resolution that you're trying to push. So that's why you see that compression um, and you see like that blurriness, especially if you look down at the track, you know, you'll definitely notice it the most there on the actual ground. Like right now, my the track to me is like super clear. There's really no compression, super clear, super detailed. See if we can move up some spots here. We're all just kind of like hanging in the same. I think I'm kind of losing them a little bit. We got we got ten to go. We are running seventh. This car's are definitely wiggling, wobbling around. Guys, let me know. You know, leave it in the comments. You know, quest two. What resolution are you running? And then what? What 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 at what frame? What frames do you guys run? Like I'm running at seventy two, and I'm gonna show you my my numbers right there. The R is at five point something. Our our GPU is at like six. And we're at a solid 71 frames, which is which, which is technically 72. The way iRacing does it, so we are like lots of headroom, great settings in iRacing. You know, everything is super smooth. And plus, I'm doing screen recording through OBS, which also you know is taxing on the computer as well. We got we got seven laps to go. We are still running P7. You know, top five would have been good, but we're, st we're still running okay. We're still running okay. Uh-oh, we got, we got a wreck going. Don't come back up. Don't come back up. Don't come back up. Stay down. Stay down. That's one car out. One car came back. Okay. Okay. I definitely want to make it to the end of the race. I want to make it to the end of the race. It's definitely an accomplishment if you can make it to an end of a race. Six to go. Six to go. It's so it's so crazy because like you know I use my Rift S also and I, and I'm like so back and forth between the Rift S and the Quest Two, but like when you pump up the Quest Two high highest resolution, it just it looks so good, so good, so clear. Still a great headset. Still still, you know, a great buy right now in 2023. Gain up on here. Gain up here. Gain up here. Gain up here. Keep it out of the wall. Keep it out of the wall. Whoa, that was close. That was close. 
I probably shouldn't have started gas. I should have waited a little bit more to start going full throttle there. You know, the one thing with Michigan is, you know, you guys, cars just really, really just, just really spread out a lot. It's really not, not, not much racing like in, in close packs. And, and I noticed that this track in iRacing, everyone just really spread out. All right, look how my wheel is like all the way turned in right now. My wheel is all the way turned in right now. And I think we're going to, we're going to finish P6. We're going to finish P6. Stay out of the wall. We're going to come in. And that's where we're going to finish. Not much happening in this race. Not much movement. Not much. Not much. Place changes. But we got, we got P6. And you know, that was, that was why I run 72 Hertz, which converts to 72 frames. I know people say they're different, but that's the frames that you're going to get is 72, you know, 80, 90. Thanks for hitting me, buddy. You know, as you didn't like see, I was like here stopped, but <laughs> that's why you finished back there. Uh, anyway, guys, leave me a comment below. A lot, of, I know a lot of you people are going to say you're crazy for running 72, but I am staying at 72 because I am completely happy with it. It is super smooth. And if it wasn't smooth, I would say, sure, I'd, I'd boost myself up, but I have no complaints. 72 runs great for me. Anyway, guys, thumb up the video. Subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. We out of here. Peace.